2000, field populations of diamondback moth were detected for resistance to spinosad insecticides in high-producing crucifer areas such as Maui, Hawaii, and Oahu. Results showed moderate to high insecticide-resistant levels at all three sites. Since then, extension professionals from the University of Hawaii College of Tropical Agriculture and Human Resources have worked with commercial crucifer crop growers on an insecticide-resistant management program for the diamondback moth. From discovery of diamondback moth resistance in 2000 until today, laboratory bioassays are used to monitor resistant levels in high producing crucifer areas. Bioassays, or exposing pests to different chemical concentrations, allow UH extension professionals to detect an increase in insecticide resistance before it becomes a significant problem. Field populations of diamondback moth are exposed to diagnostic doses of registered crop protection chemicals. When a diagnostic dose does not effectively manage field collected diamondback moth populations, UH extension professionals conclude resistant to that chemical is highly probable. To manage diamondback moth, it is also important to understand the genetics behind diamondback moth resistance. Highly resistant diamondback moth carry a resistant gene that allows them to survive chemical applications. Application of chemicals can remove susceptible pests within a population. However, if applied incorrectly, they can leave behind highly resistant pests which can continue to reproduce and become difficult to manage. UH extension professionals are encouraging growers to apply crop protection chemicals in accordance with diamondback moth insecticide resistant management program. Program recommendations include following a regional spray rotation calendar that is based on a rotation of chemicals in different chemical classes, utilization of recommended rates and spray intervals, and achieving optimum spray coverage to reduce persistence of resistant populations. A coordinated diamondback moth insecticide resistant management program has provided growers in Hawaii with timely information which has enabled them to modify crop protection chemicals in accordance with field base, research data, and insecticide resistant levels. The ability to react in a timely and responsible manner has enabled crucifer growers to avoid substantial economic crop losses, retain essential crop protection chemicals, and sustain profitable agricultural operations throughout Hawaii.